Plano. All right, Brigitte, now on Bounce, if you know a person who's had cancer, then you know how much money and support it takes to fight the disease. That's why a local organization is hosting a fundraiser to raise money for ovarian cancer research. Tonight, I want to welcome Sarah Houston, a member of the Teal Magnolias, to the show, along with her daughter, Sarita. Thanks, ladies, for being here Thank tonight. You. Thank Appreciate you for having it. Us. All right, tell us about the Teal Magnolias. What exactly is it? Well, the Teal Magnolias is a support group, <coughs> excuse me, that was started Several years ago, uh, the young ladies that were diagnosed with ovarian cancer saw a need to have uh, an advocate for them, to speak for them, and someone to just kind of guide them through the maze of dealing with ovarian cancer. Because what has happened uh, in most cases is most women are not diagnosed until they're in the later stages, the, uh, stage three and stage four. Mm -hmm. Obviously, when you find out that late in the game, there's really not a whole lot that you can do. But the one thing that they did determine was the fact that we need someone that we can come in, we can sit down and we can talk to, and they can help us to get, uh, go through this situation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so, I'm sorry. No, no, it's okay. Do you have, have personal connections to cancer? Um, yes, right now my mother is, um, you know, diagnosed with ovarian cancer right now. She got diagnosed in November of 2012, mm -hmm. and it was um, a blindsiding diagnosis for us. We did not know much about ovarian cancer at the time. We've learned a lot right. <laughs> over the past three years about, about the disease, about the statistics, and about um, the lack of awareness of the disease. So it's very important for us to, to talk about ovarian cancer, and especially talk about the signs and the symptoms, because they can mask a number of different diseases. There's mm -hmm. abdominal pain, there's bloating, there's changes in your eating habits, changes in your bowels. That could be contributed to the flu, to being sick, to any of those things. So it's very, very important for women to be in tune with their bodies. And if you see something going on that you're not quite sure about, make sure you go talk to your doctor. Yes, yeah. and it affects everybody, doesn't yes, it? Not... Yes, it is no longer a, um, a disease that is has any type of race or any type of age. It used to be, you know, older women that were getting this disease. It's no longer, that's no longer the case. So we have to be aware. All right, now you all are hosting the fifth annual Stiletto Sprint next Saturday. What are the plans for the day? By the way, I've, I've put on some stilettos before too, <laughs> in honor. I've, I've, I've worked those here, right here on WBTV. I know how tough that is to wear those, but the sprint in them, the run in them, and have fun for it. It's a good cause. Yeah, it's a it. great cause. It's a great cause. You know, we come out, you know, and everyone is in heels from our doctors to men to women to children. We have a special race for children where they can sprint. So um, you come out, it's like a 77-yard dash. And there's some pictures and, from last year, I believe. Yes, mm -hmm. in South Park Mall, and we're all tilled out, and it raises a ton of money for the Ovarian Cancer Fund at Levine Cancer Institute. So all of the proceeds um, from this event are donated to that, which is helping us do more research. But it's a fun event. Mm -hmm. You'll see a lot of good stuff <laughs> out there. <laughs> <Tell you what. laughs> it's definitely a joy, and to see our oncologists out there dressed in drag, and in heels running, it's great. It's all great. Right. All it for must, a good it, cause, it's right? must see, and it's all for a great cause. Uh, and we want to say thank you to you as well. You guys are very supportive of us. Yes. Maureen yes. is there. She's there tirelessly. Uh, she's a spokeswoman. She comes in. She gets right in there. You know, she runs. You know, she uh, she's champions all the teams. You know, yeah. she points you out. You know, I can't go, Team Sarah. Go. You know, she I and mean, she <laughs> makes it very personable. Yes. And we appreciate that. We thank you guys so much for thank coming you. behind us and uh, helping us with this cause. Well, thank you. We, uh, we're, we're happy to be a part of it. Let's take a look at some of the information. The fifth annual Stiletto Sprint is next Saturday, September 19th. It's from 8 a.m. until 1030 a.m. at South Park Mall. That's located at 4400 Sharon Road in Charlotte. For more information, log on to WBTV.com. Look in the Web Extra section under the Home tab. Ladies, thanks for being here and uh, continued success. Thank you. Thank you, thank thank you very much. much. Brigida? All right.